Can you simplify these? Let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is to apply the laws of division of square root. So if we have the square root of a divided by b is the same as the square root of a divided by the square root of b. So we are going to apply this law. So this will give us the square root of 5 divided by the square root of 6 minus the square root of 2 divided by the square root of 15. So the next step is to make sure that whenever we simplify a fraction, we want to make sure that they have the same denominator when we subtract or when we add. So the LCM of 6 and 15 is 30. So to achieve that, we are going to multiply 6 root 6 times root 5 will give us 30. And here as well, we multiply times root 5, both the numerator and the denominator. So to get 30 here, we need to multiply times root 2 times root 2. Next, we want to multiply to simplify root 5 times root 5 is 5. So we are going to get, this will give us 5 over root 6 times root 5 is root 30. Minus, we are going to have root 2 times root 2 is 2 over root 30 all square so if they now have the same denominator so we can subtract the numerator so if we do that we are going to have 3 over the square root of 30 all square so we can square both so we are going to have 3 square will give us 9 over if we square this root 30 squared, the square and the square will cancel, we left with 30. So we can now simplify this, 3 can divide both the numerator and the denominator. So if we divide 9 by 3, we get 3, 30 divided by 3, we get 10. And we can write our answer in decimal, which is 0 0.3. So this is our answer. Please support by subscribing.